back to another vlog. So for today, I am graduating. I am not too excited because like COVID. That means I'm not really going to be graduating with my classmates. We are graduating on like two to three different days. Which is kind of sad because I don't really know what the graduation is for anymore. But I guess I'm just going to be doing it for my parents. Like for them to see me graduate from school for and I would say like the second time, first time that I really really graduated with like the graduation gown and everything was when I was in kindergarten. So this time it's poly and hopefully it won't be the last graduation because um, if it's the last one that means I didn't go to uni to get my degree. But yeah, so I'm just going to be sitting here waiting for them, just wearing like a white dress, wearing heels today. Um, I think it's going to be an interesting experience graduating during the COVID period. Okay, honestly, it's been a while since I went back to school. Um, so I don't really know my way around school either. Um, I don't know, it's just kind of scary, but... I also don't know if I'll get to show you guys how it goes. I don't know if I have the courage to hold this camera up in front of my face, in front of everyone. But uh, yeah, we'll just see how it goes because I'm kind of nervous but also kind of like don't really know what to expect. Okay, so I am home from graduation and Windy is... Windy! Windy! Are you happy? I graduated today, Windy. Windy! Okay, yeah, so as I expected, there wasn't a lot of people. Um, people in the sense of people that I know. So most of them were kind of just people that... Okay, maybe there's one... Maybe I would say about two to three people that I really know. Um, at graduation, but they weren't in my class. Like, not a single one of them was in my class. So, it did feel very weird. Like, you're going to a graduation, but you're not really graduating with people that you know, people that are in your class. So, it did feel really weird. But also, I'm at home and I'm still wearing a mask. <laughs> but yeah. So, um, I feel like it is an interesting experience. I did kind of make a really big mistake though. So, when you go on stage right you have your book kind of like a folder and then you walk down the stage right and then when you go down the stage they give you this slip of paper where you can order like the photo that they took for you i think it's both hard copy and soft copy for about maybe 150 or like two dollars and after they handed me that slip of paper right within three minutes i lost it so I had to email like the email that they gave us for like any questions regarding the <laughs> uh, purchase of like pictures. So I got a little chilled out for losing that piece of paper, but it's okay, cause I still got a video of me on stage and all that. But it's just you know not a proper photo. But today when I was on the way to when I was on the way to get like to school, I got this flower over here so my parents bought it for me it has like three flowers a lot of baby breaths around and then there's this little bear that they got for me which i really really appreciate and then i thought that that was going to be like the only bouquet of flowers that i'm going to be getting today because like no one's graduating with me today right but i came home to a really really cute surprise which i really want to share with you guys so i got this bouquet of flowers I think it's really pretty. I guess it's from a place called Floral Garage. 
I don't think there are any notes. Doesn't really say who it's from. But if I'm going to guess, I'm going to guess that it's from Kelly. Okay, hold on. Let me adjust this stand first so that I can my goodness. Yeah, so I'm going to guess that it's from Kelly because oh yeah, it's from Kelly. <laughs> she wrote me a letter. It's so cute. So she said. Congrats, we made it out of MP. So glad that I got to meet you and that we became good friends. I'm so proud of you of everything that you have achieved and I wish you and I wish you and I wish you all the best. Love you, Kelly! <laughs> Thanks Kelly. Yeah, so she got me a bouquet of flowers. Um personally for me I'm a little sad that I didn't get to, you know, graduate with them because like we could have taken a lot of photos together. Probably visit like the school block once again because it has been, I would say, more than one year ever since like we went back to school to sit inside classrooms. And for my course, I feel like the classrooms are quite special because some of them are like children size, so we kind of put ourselves in children's shoes and stuff like that. But yeah, so because of that, um, we didn't, I mean because of COVID, we didn't get to graduate on the same day. So we ended up like just not meeting for graduation so I actually sent bouquets to both their houses but because I've never ordered flowers before they will only be getting it on Friday and today's a Thursday that means they should be getting it tomorrow yeah so I also want to show you guys like my folder the one that I got online can you guys see that she's scratching <laughs> yeah so this is my cert. I graduated from Nian and for other courses it's slightly different. For mine I have NIEC in it because they say that we are NIEC students studying in the Nian campus. So when we graduate we have both of it on our folders. And then so when you go onto stage you just get like kind of like an empty file. And then when you get off you go and collect your certificate. So um you cannot really collect for your friends course. I think now they kind of really want to control where you can go around plus identification and all that kind of stuff so they don't want you to move anywhere so here is my set I have finally graduated and then behind is just all of my transcripts but you know when you see it like this isn't it so satisfying so satisfying are my details on this? Ah, they are, but I don't think you can see, right? I think they're too small. So, yeah, I think that's about it for graduation. Afterwards, I just kind of went out with my friends, eat dinner, didn't really do much. Kind of just sit around, eat around, chat around. Yeah, that's about it. But I'll say it's quite funny because I managed to meet... Okay, so one friend that I met, I met JC. And then we got to take pics together. So we used to skate together in CCA. And then I also met Eddie, who gave me a broccoli for graduation so for him that's his flower that he's giving for graduation because in his defense broccoli in chinese is called silan hua so technically it is a hua which means it's a it's flowers basically but it's a three dollar flower so you know what it's the thought that counts but yeah so i guess that's about it i kind of hope that this won't be my last grad like i said earlier in the vlog but we'll see how that goes because studying is really tiring but who knows i don't think i'm really ready to go into like the working society i think i kind of want to study for a little bit longer first so that's about it and yeah i think it's quite messy a quite a messy vlog today but yeah it was really difficult especially during covid they tell us not to talk and every time i press the record button on my camera right it makes a sound so it's like when the entire place is like just quiet and i just press the record right it's a little bit awkward but i try my best to show like as much like snippets as i can throughout the day of like graduation in 2021 the year oh wait it's the second year of COVID. so yeah Hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and I'll see you guys next week. Bye!